Here we go. Officially the top two teams in world football. We can say that now, but only one will wear the crown. It's the World Cup final coming up live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Croatia against Morocco. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. And the starting 11 for Croatia. Mateo Kovacic plays with Luka Modric in central midfield. And leading the line today is Andrej Kramaric. And here's how Morocco will line up. Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper. Hakim Ziyech plays with Sofiane Bouffal in the wide positions. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And now they get the ball rolling. Amala, Sufyan Amrabat. Good looking sequence. There's a complete understanding of the game. Look at Modric. Mario Pashalic. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. Interception to snuff out the danger. Ati Adala. And successfully cut out. Amala and Nesiri. Now he must favour the cross. Well played in from the flag, but not to any great effect. Kramaric. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given.
Played in there. Kramaric. And on to Kovacic. And this is Brozovic. It needs an accurate cross. And he takes it on. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, not the best clearance. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And a good looking ball. Hakimi. A fine use of the ball. Sofian Amrabat. Well, tremendous block. And out for a throw-in, just misfiring with the pass. Amala. And Nesiri. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Well, that was a bit unlucky because you just get the feeling they need to make the most of one of these chances. Yes, in possession again, and maybe another opportunity developing here. Buffal, and it's with Amrabat. He's in here. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Andrei Kramaric. Kramaric. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. And the goalkeeper gobbling that one up. Well, those stats aren't great reading, are they? Neither side is playing with any fluency so far. And as a result, we've seen a pretty dull game. It has to get better. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Mario Pasalic. Holding it up, waiting for support to arrive. And he dealt with that ball played in rather well. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Really bright looking attack. Danger averted. A chance now with the corner.
taken short. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And yellow it is. A booking? Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. is ready well no way through Mateo Kovacic Perisic now can they counter clinically they need to get bodies back Buffal. Firing it towards goal. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Now sending it in. And he clears the danger. Ziyech. Oh, there's the goal! There's the opener! How about that? Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? And that's an important intervention. Sufyan Amrabat. That's a good looking ball. Ziyech. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Mario Pasalic. Well, they've lost the ball. Kovacic. Kramaric. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Amala. Ziyech. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Substitution time it is here. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. And it might be. 
And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and just look at these fans! The trophy coming their way, surely! Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that, he has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Just 10 minutes to go. Brozovic. Gvardiol. And Kramaric on the ball. Kovacic. Here's Kovacic. It's with Pasharic. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Over the touchline for a throw-in. And time for the change now. Perisic. Here's Modric. Brozovic. He takes aim. Oh, did so well to deny him. Can someone get on the end of this? Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Well, another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Who can he pick out? And the danger cleared. And they're trying to get right into his face. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. And perhaps a bit fortunate not to be shown the yellow card. Different story next time, no doubt. Plattered away. And the referee blows for full time. They've only gone and won the World Cup. And what a performance, not just today, but throughout the tournament. They've been absolutely brilliant. Hats off to them. The world champions. It's music to their ears and music to the ears of their fans. And this is what you dream about as a young player. And these players are now World Cup winners. It's absolutely